Installing Acumatica on premises. Acumatica allows you to control where you install your application and where you store your data. This way, if your business requirements change, you can change where your Acumatica server is located. In this video, I will demonstrate how I installed Acumatica on my laptop computer. To begin, I verify that I have installed Windows Server with .NET services and a database server. Within IIS production environments, we recommend having the dynamic compression module installed and enabled. For my database server, I'm using Microsoft SQL Express, but Acumatica works with other SQL editions, as well as MySQL open source database. I've copied the server name so I can use it later in the installation process. Next, I download the Acumatica application and start the installation wizard. The wizard is straightforward. I accept the user agreement, select the installation options, and begin. Acumatica installs in about a minute, but I edited this video to reduce that time to a few seconds. Once the installation is complete, I can deploy an instance of my application using the Acumatica configuration wizard. To create an instance, I tell Acumatica where my database server is located. Create a new database for this installation. Define whether I want a single or multi-company deployment. Since this will be a demo site, I selected the option to install demonstration data. Define my database connection. Provide my instance name and website configuration parameters. After reviewing my configuration, I start the installation. Once again, I edited this video to compress the time it takes to create an instance from a few minutes to a few seconds. I have now successfully installed Acumatica. To begin using the product, I open a browser and navigate to the URL that I defined for my website. A shortcut for doing this is automatically created in the Acumatica folder in the Windows Start menu. After changing the initial password, I can begin using Acumatica. For more information about Acumatica, visit our website to read documentation and view other videos.